The main difference between England and Hong Kong is just the intensity and the aggression that the players play with here is just way different than Hong Kong. Hong Kong, compared to here, it's slow, passing around, not doing much, whereas here it's every time someone gets the ball, 100 miles an hour, all, all out, every time. The nutritionist, there's nothing like that in Hong Kong. It was so detailed, I think we're getting a write-up at some point, and there's just unbelievable here, the nutritionist, that all the details, the sports science, the nutrition, the analysis, everything is just so detailed and so football focused. thoroughly enjoyed the experience, the attention, the family environment is probably what I did not expect um, it to be as much and I say that both with uh, understanding that they run a professional program here but at the same time I think they've done an excellent job of integrating the, the family environment aspect so it has both a professional feel as well as um, a place where you're known, where everybody's known, so it's been special. Chandler really looks to improve the player, so meet the player where they're at and take them to the next level up from where they are. So I appreciate that looking. I definitely appreciated the holistic view from um, psychology to health to tactical to the whole person. Uh, fitness is better than best it's been in my life. Uh, my one touch, two touch passing is better than it's ever been. Uh, my movement's better, my understanding of the game is better. So, yeah. I'm ready like <laughs> two times better, right? From one, from three weeks of training, so yeah. Just do it. <laughs> if you want to get better, do it. I've learned a lot from the uh, both the goalkeeper coaches, the first team, and then the academy use uh, as well. I, I'd say do it. I mean, if it'd be an opportunity you'd miss out on, it's, it's really useful and it's a lot of fun. It's, it's a plethora of different things that we're trying to get out of it. Firstly, is this a place that in our off season would be a really good spot for some of our players to come out and, and train by themselves. Um, is it a good place that, that we can recommend them to, to be able to get to get some good training and, and to be taken care of properly, uh, be in the right people's hands and look after? Uh, I think today clearly the answer to that is yes. Um, but also from a personal level, the, the sort of contacts and networking where we can potentially um, just make our program better, make our team better, make our staff better. Uh, give our women opportunity to to grow and, and um, open some new doors um, and, and be able to just build a partnership that, that can last in a way that, that everyone can can gain from it things that you just want to be able to um, use to to improve yourself and your team and, and as far as we're concerned I feel like we're, we're in a position to be able to do that now.